Good morning, everybody. This is Nate Green over at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. And today, of course, it's almost 30 degrees outside when it was crazy windy and cold a few days ago. But I'm outside with another video for you. And today, I have a 2024 Flagstaff ePro 15 TB. It's gonna be a shorter video because this is a smaller ePro, but uh, let's cover some features on the outside and then we'll head on to the inside. So right off the bat, you're gonna have your power tongue jack with your light here. You're gonna have two 20 pound propane tanks that we do install upon uh, purchase, as well as a battery that'll also be installed upon purchase. You do have your rock guard up here to take care of that front end. And then take a step back here so we can see the front cap. You also do have a light right below right here. There it is. I'm gonna step back off to the side. This does not have a slide out. So we're gonna do a side profile of the 15 TB. Frameless windows, privacy glass. You do have your manual jacks here. And then of course you do have your gray water holding tank, sewer outlet connection there. You have your all-terrain tires, nitrogen inflated. 30 amp service here. And if I can do this with one hand, which I can, you do have an outdoor shower hookup here. Table satellite city water connection. Fresh water fill here. And then you do have your hot water heater here. Now we're gonna take a step back. I'm gonna back up all the way here so we can take a look at the rear of the 15 TB. So you're gonna see right up top that you're gonna have a backup camera prep system there. You're gonna have your ladder to get up onto your roof, clean off any, uh, any gunk that might be up there. And then of course you do have your hitch here. And if this is open, which it is thankfully, we're gonna have our outdoor attachments and then we're also gonna have that uh, nozzle for the shower. But this storage, as you can see, runs all the way through and you do have a grill that comes with this. Once I uh, head back around here, you do have a slot where that grill attaches, but you can store from here or you can see the door right there where you can store from as well. But you have a lot of different access points if multiple, diff or if multiple people are storing things in here, which I really like. So I'm gonna come around to the other side and we'll get that side profile here. The door open, we got the steps down. You know, for a smaller ePro, this actually does have a lot of equipment on it, a lot of standard features that I really enjoy. So coming back down here, there's your LP disconnect. Coming back up, here's that grill attachment that I mentioned. You do have your outdoor speakers. You do have a power awning, but just due to a little bit of cold outside here, I didn't have that to open, but it is power. And then right underneath that, you do have a large uh, LED strip here to kind of illuminate your campsite. Now, in the previous videos that I've done for the Flagstaff, like I said, I'm passionate about this product. I really love the Flagstaff brand. Um, they put everything on the doors uh, in terms of build quality, where everything's labeled, where everything is. It's, it's really nice to have just as a reference point. So I'm gonna turn the camera around. I'm gonna show that here. So feel free to pause the video, get a little bit more information, and then we'll jump onto the inside. So there's that superior construction that I talk about here. Standard features such as a 200 watt solar panel. Just gonna go down a little bit further here. Like I said, feel free to pause the video. I'm gonna move over. And like I was mentioning here, everything is just numbered. So the numbers here, you can just kind of correlate to uh, the right side here. Very good build quality. Take a step back here. And we'll head on inside. Grab handle here, and then one thing I, I'm sorry I forgot to mention, you do have your furnace, and then you do have your GFCI outlets off to the side here. But let's head inside. So your command center, or your control panel, is gonna be all right here, digital, and this light, even if it's dark outside, will automatically come on, it is motion detected. And then for extra qualities on your phone, you can download uh, the app to get a little bit more uh, uh, control, such as diagnostics, things like that. 
And then since this is a smaller unit, I'm gonna turn the camera around and kind of face the bed slash eating entertainment area. Um, so right now it's set up for, you know, just lounging or enjoying company, dinner, whatever it might be. But this is gonna be your sleeping station for when this table comes down and this uh, part of the table comes over it. But as it stands right now, you do have your twin beds 30 by 74. But what I like about this as well is you do have a lot of natural light that enters this 15 TV. Storage up above there. Here's our AC. And you have multiple different lights or multiple lights to give you a little bit more brightness in here. You do have your thermostat here, GFCI outlets here, refrigerator switch here, and then you do have your solar controller right here. But up above the twin beds, let's take a look at some of the storage. So you'll see that runs all the way through. It's a little bit dark, but I'll open up the other cupboard. And you can see we got a lot of room to work with. Storage up above here. And then off to the other side, we got more storage, large storage here. Again, everything runs all the way through. And then in this, you'll just have your information on the 15 TB here. And then more power outlets kind of hidden, but they are scattered throughout the, uh, the 15 TB here. So you have no problem charging your devices. 32 inch TV capable of your Netflix, YouTube, Prime Video, and Disney Plus. And this TV can come out and swivel so you can enjoy it with friends and family here. But there is storage down below here as well. Just sitting down on this twin bed here. You're gonna see these are also those storage pockets from outside coming in. So if it's a rainy day or anything like that, you can actually store from inside so you don't have to go outside and get soaking wet. Another outlet here. And then coming up, we'll take a look at our fridge. If I can do this one-handed, there we go. Here's our freezer. And our fridge. Storage down below, large storage, nice to have. And then coming over into your kitchen area. So everything's gonna be all in one. You're gonna have your sink, your uh, three burner cooktop. And then of course we are gonna have our convection microwave down below. And our fire extinguisher off to the right. And then I really like this here. I call this the tower of power. So you have multiple device charging outlets here as well. And then a wireless charger up top. Going over some more storage. Sorry if that's a little bit loud. And then again, looking up above. Right up above me here, you do have that fan. And then let's get into the bathroom here. The last part of the 15 TB. Now this is a wet bath, but you know, smaller campers are gonna have some things like that, but it's really not bad actually. So you're gonna have your toilet here. And then of course you are going to have your shower. So everything all in one, you do got a lot of privacy. And then opening up this little cubby here, you do have your storage for anything that uh, is bathroom, bathroom needed. So able to work, you can sit down, you can get your business done and then come back out, enjoy things with your friends and family. But that's gonna do it for this video on this EPRO 15TB. My name's Nate Green from Bullion RV. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Smash that like button, subscribe to our channel. We're gonna really go hard this year. We're gonna try and get to 20,000 subscribers. I think we're close, maybe I'm wrong, but let's get there. But again, Nate Green over at Bullion RV. My information and information on this unit will be in the box below, but my number 218-740-4965. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you in the next one.